Generally, when people have influenza, the treatment is supportive and treating the symptoms. So we recommend using um, analgesics for discomfort and antipyretics such as Tylenol or ibuprofen to combat the fever. People with influenza have fever and therefore they're more likely to get dehydrated because when you have a fever you lose fluids more rapidly. Plus there can be associated vomiting and diarrhea with it. So we recommend that people drink copious amounts of fluid to stay well hydrated. Not just plain water but generally some fluids like uh, half strength Gatorade is a good example that have some electrolytes and some sugar or glucose in it. The electrolytes help provide some of the sodium and, and other electrolytes that you need. And the glucose, the sugar in the drink, helps facilitate absorption from the stomach into the blood system. So that is a, a very important thing. The next thing is to help protect the other people in the home from contracting influenza. The person should stay at home and not go out. They should sleep in a room by themselves and one person at home should be designated as the primary caregiver and that person if possible should wear a mask when they're in the room taking care of that person and should always wash their hands frequently especially after coming into contact uh, with that person or with their plates or glasses. There should be no sharing of uh, toothbrushes, cigarettes, uh, 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 silverware or glasses amongst that person to help mitigate the uh, spread of the infectious disease. Now if that person who is known to have this novel strain of influenza that is now being called swine flu needs to go out of the house, the best thing is to put a mask on that person uh, when they're out in public or going to their primary care provider or even going to the emergency department.